as the car is so nicely introduced, we are starting with a course of blueberries for dinner. Cheers. Cheers. Now you feed me, I'll feed you. Dakari really likes his blueberries. There's a lot of bites and there's a lot of ways to eat them. He even came up with this little blueberry dance in between each bite. I'm sucking it up better. Mm, 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 mm. I'm eating yours. You're eating mine? Yeah. Grab the whole handful. <laughs> so after we finished our blueberry boogie, and Dakari decided to finish mine as well. I can you. You are. We moved on to the soup recipe. And there's Dakari ever snacking away on the ingredients. Cucumber. 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 Here's Dakari wanting to display the hat he just got from his aunt Shannon. I'm chef. Oh, you're a chef, yeah. This show just got a whole lot more professional now that we got a full time chef on board. And so we're peeling the cucumber. I'm sure you could probably blend it with the skin on as well. We just preferred it without it. And the next step was just cutting the little ends off the cucumber and cutting the cucumber into little chunks. Eat it. Dakari thought this would be an appropriate time for a snack. Second trip. And then place the cucumber chunks into the blender. Here we are peeling our tangerines. We then had to take the seeds out and place them into the blender. I would highly recommend using some citrus that didn't have seeds. I eat it. Eat it. I eat it. On to the next ingredient, and on cue, Dakar is eating it, which is a Roma tomato. Then toss it on in the blender and proceed to the blending. Yeah. Then blend till you reach consistency you like. We pretty much did straight all the way to a puree. Then turn the blender off and taste to see if it's at a taste you like. Okay, so the soup passed Dakari's taste buds, but it's very easily adjusted to anyone's. You could add more tomato or more citrus. Or you could add in some basil or some other fresh herbs to give it a different taste. So there's a lot of ways to experiment. So feel free to, to test out your own methods. We'll do avocado too. Yes. Yeah. More avocado? Do it my first. Do my first. Here's the car I call in dibs on the avocado. Hard to keep this kid away from avocado. And we added a little bit of diced tomato as well to give it some other texture. Here's Dakari practicing his chewing technique of his soup, making sure he gets everything chewed up really nicely. I'm gonna show it. You gonna show it? Soup. What's in the soup? The the avocado and mayo. Let's see. Does he like it? I don't know. We can rip off a little bit of crunchy green. And then dip a little bit in. I love 
Guarda. <laughs> Thank you, Sam. <laughs> How much lettuce did you just stick in your mouth? Four. That's a lot of lettuce. I cut cut. You chew it? I cut cut. I cut cut cut. You get that? Why don't you chew it up first? <laughs> But chew it all up, chew it all up, and then the. <laughs> I can cut now. <laughs> I'll put it in the cup. Hi! 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 How many take smaller bites? Oh wow, that's a really nice piece of soup there you got there. That's some real nice soup there. Ooh. Thank you. Would you care to take a little bite of me? <laughs> Thank you. You're very welcome. I'll help you to grow nice and strong. Can you sing a song for me? Okay. We'll grow stronger. I feel freedom. Yay! You did that. Bravo! Thank you. Thank you. You did too. Okay, let's sing it together. When I get older, I feel stronger. I feel freedom. Ski 